Let's now see how this uh, script works, the color menu PL, as we already saw explanation. But let's uh, run it now. I type in Perl and the name of the script. It will show up this menu. So the numbers are here. And then this uh, closing parenthesis is just there because for it's like beautiful, right? So it's uh, just for uh, to make it ni nicer a little bit. And then um, you have the, the colors and then you can select one of them. So for example, I pick two and it will tell me that I selected brown. And if I run it again and I select three, then it will be white and that's okay. And if I run it again and I picked four, then it will tell me it's a bad selection because it's outside of the range. And if I tell it I'm picking, um, just pressing enter, then it will complain a little bit. Argument isn't numeric. The empty string isn't numeric. Well, it's not a number, right? But then it goes on and selects blue. So it evaluates in it to as a zero. And that would be the same if I just tell, type here x and then it would complain a little bit and that it's complaining if I go back because of the use warnings without that it wouldn't even complain let's actually see it so if the, the color manuscript if I change it and uh, sorry if I change it remove the warnings and then run it again and type it X then it silently just works incorrectly of course it selects blue, so that's why it would be important to be more uh, strict in, in our input, input check. Now this is how it works.